when I went to school as a child to shul, I was happy. I was satisfied. I had some wonderful teachers. I had other types of teachers. But I don't think I had complaints. But as I matured and I began to take Jewish studies very seriously intellectually, academically, and of course that became my chosen field, I became very resentful of this education. Resentful that it had been imposed upon me and that I devoted so much time and devotion to it and resentful that I contributed to it as a teacher. Because I felt as an adult that the heart of Jewish identity and the Jewish experience had been cut out of it. And it had been reduced to a very low, low level. The teachers had a, did not have a real grasp on what Yiddish, what the meaning of Yiddish is, and how the language should be taught. So we were taught, generally, there are exceptions, but generally, a very anemic, Germanized, Americanized Yiddish, a de-Judaized Yiddish which now I understand is ridiculous, is not Yiddish, because of course Yiddish means Jewish, and the whole raison d'etre of this language is that it is a Jewish language to convey Jewish values and the Jewish experience rooted in the Bible and in post-biblical rabbinic literature, whether one is a believer in the traditional sense or not, and that this was not really Yiddish. So 